Hey man, what's going on? It's Big Dog Bog and the Country Boy from Memphis, Tennessee. Welcome to Sports Zone TV, where we talk about relationships, sports, and everything in between. And this video right here, I want to ask y'all guys something. Is twerking really that bad when you're looking for a potential mate? Is watching a woman pop her backside hat uh, <laughs> a bad thing, a red flag? I mean, let's be honest. When you were growing up as a young man, depending on where you stayed, the suburb, the hood, whatever the case may be, and you went to house parties, went to the club, or whatever the case may be, you would dance with a female that was popping her ass. And we just gonna be perfectly honest. You were dancing with a female that was popping that thing. Let's just keep it real. She had to be cute, yeah, you know what I'm saying? But if you on the dance floor and you see shouting moving that thing, you're gonna try to get behind it. And we already know how that goes. If you get behind it and she look back at you and she don't move, she good to go. She like what she see behind her, you know what I'm saying? If she look back there and she don't like what she see, she gonna move or she gonna stop shaking, one or the other. You know what I'm saying? And let's keep it real, let's keep it 100. If she ain't moving that thing like you want her to move, you gonna move. Or you might stay a little bit long because she look a certain type of way, but majority of the time, if she ain't throwing that thing right, you ain't finna stand back there too much long, let's just keep that 100. So my question again is, is twerking bad? when you're trying to find that potential mate. You know what I'm saying? Now, I get it. I understand. If she's trying to walk her like a dog or whatever the case may be, trying to turn to her own adult show, you know what I'm saying? Then I, I feel you, you know, you know, chalk that up and take it for what it is. You know what I'm saying? That might be a one hit acquittal. quit It is what it is. But the truth of the matter is, man, women like to pop their body. Women like to dance. Women like to move. You know what I'm saying? If it's a little twerking, a little shaking here and there, you know what I'm saying? That cool, bro. Don't don't be so offended about the chick, man, doing what she doing, man. You like it. <clears throat> let's not let's not act like we don't like to see women move their bodies. You like it. Now if it's just egregious, like I said, she walking like a dog. And she's just waiting for a leash to be attacked, you know, attached to her neck and whatever the case may be. Hey. It is what it is, bruh. Do what you gotta do. But one thing I'ma tell you though, <clears throat> what does she Walking like a dog or just doing a little twerking here and there. That's just part of the game. That's just part of it. Because once you get the, that physical attraction out the way, you got to know what you're dealing with. You know what I'm saying? You got to know what type of female she is. You got to ask some questions, see what her mind is. You know what I'm saying? Y'all sitting up here just worried about the physical all the time, man. The physical is what gets you there. It's the mentality that's going to keep you there. You know what I'm saying? So when you get with somebody that been twerking and shaking, doing their thing, you know what I'm saying? They cool with that. Whatever you're going to do with it, you're going to do with it. Y'all cool with it, y'all cool with it. But you got to understand her brain, too. You got to see where she going for. You just chalk up to just being a one-hit acquittal. You know what I'm saying? You got to see she might have some potential. You ain't never know. Anyway, man, subscribe to my channel for more content like this. And I'm going to get up with y'all another time.